So, welcome to Big Zig's cooking studio. With no other than Big Zig. What up? What up, Big Zig? So, what are you cooking tonight? Well, tonight I am cooking potatoes and steak and broccoli and uh, green and red peppers steamed. Um, yeah, for the family, you know what I mean? So, uh, I have. I have quite a lot of experience cooking, a lot of people don't know that, you know, so, I'm, yeah, I'm a man in the kitchen, you know what I'm saying, I like, I love to cook because I love to eat, you know what I mean, so. Well, that's wonderful, so what is your favorite dish? You mean, my favorite dish, a couple of my favorite dishes. To eat, of course. I can't say that on camera. Anyway, um. No. Fine, 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 then we said no, with no, the no. one to cook. <laughs> no, 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 my favorite dish, uh, my favorite dish to cook would probably be, I know because I'm black, you motherfuckers expect me to say fried chicken. Wrong! Uh, stuff like stromboli, lasagna, um, a lot of people don't know what stromboli is. Uh, that's an Italian dish, actually. Um, it's like a big giant pizza bread. So, why don't y'all come on over here to the kitchen and see what I'm cooking up? All right, all right, all right. Yeah, right here we got the steaks. You know what I'm saying? We got the steaks right here, all seasoned up. You know what I mean? Then we got the, uh, we got the, you know, the green peppers and red peppers and the broccoli in here. You know what I mean? So we gotta do the dang one thing one more again. You know what I'm saying? I got a big spoon, so I got. Ooh, this is good. The only problem about the camera is that you can't smell it. Here you go, look. Smell that? Smells good. Anyway, you know what I'm saying? You know, brother like to eat, so a brother like to cook. I learned how to cook from my mother, my grandmother, my aunts. You know, always being in the kitchen. You know, ain't no shame in a man cooking. The fastest way to a woman's heart is through her stomach. A little humor for you, mama. So we're going to go back over here and peel the potatoes. All right. All right, there you go. Peel the right on. We're going to peel the potatoes. That's right. Freaking A, man. So that means we as the audience have to peel the potatoes. No, so you. that means you as the audience get to sit here and ask me questions while you watch me peel potatoes. Oh. I know all you, all you women out there who always say, oh my God, that's women's work. Well, you got a man in the kitchen right now, okay? They're a damn fine one if I might have myself. You know what I'm saying? I mean, the only problem with me being so fine is that I can't date myself. Oh, you want to date yourself? No, no, no. I'm just making jokes, you know what I'm saying, for the audience out there. Why would I want to date myself? I got a fine-ass woman, you know what I'm saying? I'm not gay. I'm not confused either. I like women. You know what I mean? That's what's up. That's what's up. Yeah, that's what's up. So, what else uh, should the audience who's watching... You know, Big Dick and Cook Show, you know what I mean? And you know what? I think I might actually just start doing this, um, like, every week. Cook a new dish every week for the audience. You know, and then y'all can watch, and I can uh, show you how to prep. You know, all that good stuff right there, you know what I'm saying? Sounds really, really good. Yeah, so what would you like to see Big Dick cook in the future? For, 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 for the YouTube audience? Well, for you should world. know already. <laughs> no, Matt, you so you got, no, no, you are the camera. You are <laughs> representing the audience. Of course. You are the camera person, but you are representing the audience right now. So you got to tell me what you what you think that the audience would want to see me cook. Yes, sir, some mashed potatoes, of course. Well, that's what I'm doing right now. You watch me physically peel the potatoes. I mean, look, look I'll tell you what. Anyway, if you wanted fresh mashed potatoes, guess what? You got to plant them and grow them your dad on stuff. Don't go out and pull them up yourself. Dang oh, that's what's up. Shiggity. Yep. So what we're going to do here in a minute is I'm going to run these potatoes underwater, which you should do, because all pesticides, normally you're supposed to rinse off all potatoes and all vegetables that come out of the ground. You should let them sit in water for about 10 minutes just to be safe, you know, for pesticide reasons and all that other stuff. A lot of people don't know that. You know what I'm saying? But of course. Of course, of course. So what else do you like to do? What else do I like to cook? I like to cook. I like to cook meat things. I'm from Maryland myself, so you know I. I mean, a brother, a brother had to learn to cook because a brother loved to eat. I cannot stress that enough. All good eaters are good cookers. Fat people.
people never feel good can do that? No, they don't. That's not nothing against big people. You know what I'm saying? I mean, you know, I said to my check that out, check that out. Look how wonderful that looks. Check that out. Looks good, doesn't it? I know. Smells good too. Well, too bad man. the audience can't smell that though. Well, that's okay. I'm pretty sure y'all all know what the steak smell like. So just think about what a steak smell like and look at that, and then you'll be all right. You know what I'm saying? So that's how we get down over here. Yeah. So uh, you know. So right now you're the steak security. Yeah. I'm the food security. I mean, if anybody tries to take my, touch my food, you know, hey, they gonna need security. I tell you that. <laughs> okay, we got some seasonal right here, right? That's seasonal right there. But this is not seasonal because I use all seasonal. This is actually Old Bay, you know what I'm saying, a Baltimore specialty. But it is made all over uh, the United States. Um, you know, but uh, we in Europe, you can't get in Europe unless you go to a specialty store. But seasonal Morton, you know, normally the seasonal season salt. You know, used for vegetables and things like that. But we're going to use it for our steak tonight to season. That's really good, brother, well, and I hope that your food turns out to be great. Oh, believe me, you'll be here when the food turns out. This is only part one of many. So, you know, I know you want to see Big Zig cook some more, so it's all good. So, uh, you know, stay tuned for part two through, I don't know what, but stay tuned. And I hope you enjoyed the show, and I hope I made you hungry and made your mouth water looking at the steak. I'll let you boy one time. Big Zig, Heartland Productions, one. One.